My name is Adrian Yearwood, and I teach a couple courses at Focus Learning. I teach Harry Potter, The Untold Story, and various other Harry Potter-themed classes. I teach a couple of critical reading classes, one for each of three age groups, sort of a level one, level two, level three type of deal. And I teach creative writing, uh, specifically The Hero's Journey, which is a form of short storytelling that I truly love and I love teaching the structure of it to students. So many literature courses, especially classes that I taught growing up or that I took growing up as a student, um, I was always a really big reader and, and I love reading all books, so it wasn't a big problem for me, but so many of my peers hated, hated literature class because they just didn't like reading and they didn't think that the books were interesting. And so one of the things I get to do through focused learning is to teach classes that are, are based around books that students actually love to read, which is why I teach classes on books like Harry Potter or Percy Jackson. But we can still approach it from an academic standpoint and talk about you know, themes and literary devices, but in the context of something that we really enjoy. I hope that my students through my course will gain an appreciation for the written word, um, whether they're reading it or writing it themselves. And I uh, hope that my students gain an appreciation for learning in general and discussion. Uh, I love to have verbal class discussions and to speak about books because I think that one of the best ways to understand novels and literature is to speak about it with your peers or with your contemporaries. And so that's the main thing that I hope my students gain from the course. I pride myself on engagement. I really, really make an effort to engage with all of my students. And one of the ways that I do that is through class discussions. I love asking students questions uh, directly, not just fact-based questions, but opinion-based questions. Getting students to be able to relate things to themselves and talk about their opinions, I think is extremely valuable because one of the things that I've always thought is that people don't care about kids' opinions. People don't want to hear their opinions. They want to impress their own opinions upon them and have them be regurgitated back to them. But I don't like that. I like to hear what the students actually think about these things so that I can respond and tailor my lessons and tailor my delivery of it to what they're interested in and the direction that they're already thinking. My students' lives will improve because they will gain an appreciation for the craft of learning, I hope. I hope that they take these classes, they start to love reading and start to tease more things out of reading, which then allows them to want to learn more. I think the best part of my job is seeing a student go from reserved and withdrawn and thinking that what they have to say doesn't matter or isn't important to a student being proud and confident with what they have to say about a particular subject. Uh, focus learning and focus online are a really, really excellent way for students to push themselves forward academically, but in a setting that is low stress and uh, is fun. I think that the, the stress of evaluation in school is necessary on some level, but on another level really excludes students who just don't respond to that type of pressure or that type of, of, of teaching style or learning style. So I think this is a great way for students to be able to learn and grow in an environment that encourages that, but doesn't oppress them with, you know, strict massive deadlines and epically large tests and, and huge competition amongst the students. It's, it's a safe space for people to grow and to learn and I appreciate that.